Okay, you're dropped into the console. You just signed up for RHR. Now what? Well, we're just going to quickly show you how to connect to a station, power it up, and tune around. Okay, so here we go. You just signed up, and we're going to drop in. And right now, we have bouvets happening. Through three, three Yankee Zero is, is on the air, so that's why there's... <laughs> A lot of activity currently. So let's go ahead and um, let's go to 40 meters here in Jonesport. Let's go ahead and uh, hit, basically, you just hit the green connect button. You select your station over here on the left, okay? And just by clicking on it, and you'll see here it'll change here, whatever the station you're connected to, okay? And so let's go to 40 meters Jonesport, um, and let's go ahead and power up the station. We'll hit the connect button. Okay, and here we are. We have a pan adapter, and we see a whole bunch of signals on the band, and we have a VFO down here to the right uh, on, on 40 meters, 7060. And we have a number of things here. Some of this stuff might look a little different from what you will see, but it'd be very, very close. Uh, we can see there's actually two slices open here, or two VFOs open here on this station. We can just close this one. And now we have one single VFO. And let's go into lower sideband. And we could do a number of things here. We can just take our mouse up here in the pan, and we can just cl start clicking on Radio and he, he gave me his, uh, stations in this pan adapter. And you can click and drag uh, to fine tune. Okay, so I'm, I'm clicking and dragging. Right, or you can just click. Right. So you have to do. All right. So uh, a couple other things here. If you look at the top, let me just turn this down a little bit. If you look up at the top here in the pan adapter, you see these color color uh, boxes, and these are the band maps, right? And so the band segments. So if you want to just look at the phone portion, just click the phone, just click the blue bar, and now it perfectly sizes that pan adapter for the whole portion of the 20 meter phone or 40 meter phone band right and if you want to look at the whole 40 meter band just click the green bar at the top and this is the entire 40 meter band the band band map and if you just want to see cw here's just cw and so on and so forth right so this really uh gives you a beautiful uh view and of we also, spectrum want to of bandwidth that move the yagi to clean, the antennas to a different portion uh, of the globe right so here we can see we got a stack of yaggies in this case right a bottom yagi and a top yagi bottom yagi is going to be fixed and the top yagi is on a rotor so we get rid of the bottom one, and let's right now we're obviously pointing towards Africa. And if we just hit the EU uh, uh, preset here, you'll see the Yagi is now turning towards Europe. So you're turning this monstrous four-element Yagi at almost 200 feet on the coast of Maine. And now we're looking into Europe. And these are just quick presets. And you can type anything in this go anywhere box. You can type grid squares, sodas, um, call signs, prefixes, um, et cetera, et cetera, right? So let's say um, uh, you, you hear nine United four radio on the air, right? You type in the call sign, hit enter, and boom, drops a pin right on the map. And you'll see the Yagi will turn to that station. Um, this obviously is your... Um, Antenna description, what the antenna is. This is where it's pointing, obviously the band. And we have our little um, logging uh, entry here. We'll, we'll go into more detail in, in other uh, video tutorials, but this is just to get you started, okay? So, and then when you're done um, with the radio, you simply come up here at the top right and you click disconnect and you're done. That's And that's the simple way of just powering on a station and start to uh, get familiar with the RHR console.